Mellow greetings to all of you collectors of rectangle cardboard pieces. <laughs> okay, part two of the Hall of Fame slash Legends PC. We're going to dive right into it, pick up where we left off. Uh, we're starting with the Cowboys. I've got some inserts here. Let's see, let's put those out of the way. Uh, Emmett Smith, dual jersey, numbered to 250. We've got a Bob Lilly out of National Treasures, triple jersey. We've got a Randy White jersey. Really nice Chuck Howley. Look at that thing. Beautiful patch, stitching, something that's kind of puffy. That's number 10 of 25. We've got a really nice Dee Dee Lewis two color patch, number uh, to 10. Everson Walls autograph. Kind of cool. Rocket Ismail. Just signs Rocket. Got a Tony Door set. Piece of the number plate there. Part of the nine from his shoulder. And that'd be numbered 50 of 50. Here's an old school Michael Irvin. Two color jersey from Pieces of the Game. Tops Triple Threads. Roger Staubach. Three piece jersey and we're dealing with that friggin glare again today there's Randy White on card auto press pass one I just acquired recently Rayfield Wright it's out of Leaf Ed Tutel Jones accolades that's out of playbook and that's number 49 Mel Renfro autograph yeah that was my ugly mug in the reflection there Here's Bob Lilly's auto. That's out of Obak. Obak. 20 door set. Out of Legendary Contenders, number to 25. There's Michael Irvin, Legendary Contenders. Emmett Smith, and that's the number to 250 version. Beautiful on card autograph. Love that card, and from the same set, the Troy Aikman. Inscribed number 8. Really like that. We got a Roger Staubach cut. That's out of National Treasures, number to 27. And I guess I just realized I have two Troy Aikman autographs. And that's Sign of the Times. So that's the Cowboys. Next up is the Dolphins. We've got a Dick Anderson. Gino Capaletti, number to 99, Legends and Hall of Famers. A.J. Dewey, he's a legend because it says so. Hey, nice number, buddy. I like him. Dwight Stevenson, might have heard of this guy before. It's Dan Marino, got to have a game used in there, so there's a jersey of his. Had a patch card of his, but I gave it away. Uh, Bob Greasy, a really nice three-color patch there. Beautiful. I'm working on getting a Bob Greasy autograph. There's a lot of them out there. Just waiting for it to get one at the right price. This is a Larry Little two-color patch. That's numbered uh, 49. Irving Fryer autograph. Really liked him when he played. Number to 49. There's Mark Clayton of the Duper and Clayton fame. The Marx Brothers, followed up by Super Duper. I dig the fact that he signs his autograph that way. And that was numbered to 162. Go figure. Uh, Larry Zonka, one of my favorite cards in my collection because it's a beautiful autograph, hard to find. The card itself is absolutely flawless and beautiful to look at. Sometimes I get aroused when I look at that card. And the last one, Dan Marino, on card, five star, number 12 of 15, just missed his uniform number. Speaking of Dan Marino, I also got this great big die cut thing from way back in 93 SP, I think. Could be wrong, but yeah, so I hold on to that. That's pretty cool. So that's the Dolphins. Move those back. And next up is the Eagles. 
we'll start off with a it's hard to read these cards. Anyone else have trouble reading these? One, this uh, timeline out of now. I think it's Chuck Bednarik. Can't even read the name on there. It's ridiculous. Nice card design. Dick weeds. Number 25. Got a Pete Retzloff. Legendary Contenders autograph. Javon Curse. Sunday Signatures. Number to 299. Jaws, Ron Jaworski. Love that guy. Loved him then. Love him now. Randall Cunningham, three color, well they call it patch, autograph, numbered 15, nice low numbered. Chuck Bednarik, auto, and another guy I really loved, Harold Carmichael, grew up watching him play. So that's the Eagles, not a very big list. Give me some ideas below who else might be a legend or if I'm missing a Hall of Famer, I don't know, if, I don't think I am there. Falcons. I just threw that in there because they did draft Brett Favre. You got a Steve Bartkowski on card autograph out of the 97 legend set. That's a buyback, by the way. There's another Favre rookie that's out of uh, Action, pa action Packed. Uh, threw this in there because it was a first day production, first day issue of from Stadium Club Deion Sanders, so that card still holds some value. As does the official rookie card of Keith Brooking out of SP Authentic. Because back in the day, they did number them, and when it was numbered, it was a pretty big deal. I'm not sure how that got put in there, so I'll pull that out. Um, Bartkowski again, two color patch. Work done. Close to a legend. Close enough. Went with it. Another Bartkowski. Jumbo patch. Jesus, and another Bartkowski. This one's really nice because you actually got old school Atlanta Falcon patch in there. Probably part of the nameplate. Then a guy that I really like, definitely a legend, Andre Risen. And the gold version of that as well. Got both of those. Number to 49. And. Shit, those are both the gold version. What kind of an idiot am I? I thought I had the silver and the gold. Here's the accolades, a rare instance where he signs his name actually on the whole sticker. And this guy's autographs are always different. They're, they're, he never has two autos that are the same. That kind of pisses me off about him. Ever since Lisa left, I Lopez burned his house down. He's never been the same. Bartkowski, legendary auto. I guess I have a lot of Bartkowski in here, so I should probably whittle that down a little bit. If anyone's interested in doing a trade for some of those Steve Bartkowski's, I don't need all those. Tommy Nobis, he's a Hall of Famer. Love this. Hook'em Horns. Inscribed for Texas Longhorn Days, number 60. And that one was a short print one. Morton Anderson. Very nice autograph. A little smiley face there. Hi, how you doing? Tommy McDonald did play for the Falcons. I know that because it says it right there. And Deion Sanders from Proline, there's the seal, and his money signature on the back. That's an awful lot of Falcons cards for being in a Legend and Hall of Fame collection. Probably shouldn't all be there. Sue me. Next, we have the 49ers. So, let's get to it. Ronnie Lott, Jersey. Hugh McElhenney, blue jersey, interesting. We've got Joe Cool, Joe Montana, two color jersey, tools of the trade, that's numbered to 50. A beautiful Joe Perry patch, old school, that's number to 25 out of National Treasures. Got a really nice Jerry Rice, three color patch, black, gold, white, out of Exquisite. Another Jerry Rice, game used, worn, just all looking ratty as hell, number to 25. Fred Davis autograph, legend. Roger Craig. Hugh McElhenney autograph, that's hand numbered, 200. We got a Terrell Owens, that's the number to 250 version. Jeff 
there almost wasn't enough room on this card to sign my goddamn name. It's so huge. Garcia. One of my favorites, John Taylor on the Legends. And I got this one too because I liked it and it was inscribed 82. That's from Classics, number 250. That's an older one. And last but not least on John Taylor from Honorable Signatures. I ended up winning a couple extras while I was trying to acquire one of his cards. So be it. Here's Jerry Rice. Material monikers, number to 25. These are all jacked up in the wrong order. Another Terrell Owens. On card autograph. I don't even know what that's from. It's from Tops, something or other. Really nice Century National Treasure. Steve Young. Look at that beautiful patch there. And autograph. And the nice, oh, that's a low number one to 25. And of course, you couldn't have 49ers without a Joe Montana auto. Beautiful. A lot of honors, honorable signatures. So that's the 49ers. Okay. Giants. New York Giants. We got an old 1954 YA Tittle. Patchworks of Lawrence Taylor. And I am looking for a Lawrence Taylor autograph. Notable numbers of Michael Strahan. Or I should say Michael Thwayhan. You could drive your car between his teeth. Y.A. Tittle. Patch. Out of National Treasures. Really beautiful two color patch. R raised right up off the card. Eli Manning. And I did just win an Eli Manning autograph. Yesterday. It will not be here in time for this. But I will show it when it comes in. So I do have Eli taken care of. Really nice old school Sam Huff. Patch, look at that, up close. Get your face in there. Rub your nose in that patch. And that's numbered to, what the hell is that, 50? Harry Carson autograph. Nice. And once again, there's Michael Thrahan. Inscribed 92. I always loved this guy. I always loved this guy. Jason Seahorn, nice auto. Way to utilize all of the negative space on that card. Well done. Amani, it's not a Duma. Maybe a legend. Frank Gifford. I've heard of him. Nice low number to 28. Uh, here's a nice rosy brown cut auto given to me at the 2011 National in Chicago by my good friend Jason Bigfish. Number to 150 on that cut. We got a YA Tittle autograph. Really nice autograph, Tiki Barber. Kind of a piss baby though. Uh, inscribed number 21. He ran his mouth and got himself in some trouble. And a nice Phil Sims out of Supreme. I just love those cards. They're absolutely beautiful. Why I'm not doing one of the year set is beyond me. Giants. Again, if I'm missing any players in here, please note in the comments below. Next is the, uh, let's see, Jaguars. This will be a quick one. Mark Brunel, maybe a legend, maybe not. Was a legend, now he's a convict. Jimmy Smith, too bad, loved him. And that, I'm working on getting a uh, Maurice Jones Drew autograph because he will, go. by the time it's all said and done, he will be a legend. Jets, J-E-T-S, Jets, Jets, Jets. All right, we've got a Ronnie Lott jersey. We've got an Art Monk jersey, even though he will also be featured in the Redskins. We've got a Joe Namath jersey. I like to have some game use and autos of all these players. Really nice, big, fat, thick patch of Curtis Martin when he was on the Jets. I love, love, love this card. Don Maynard, Joe Namath, dual patch. So you got the green, white, and then the inverse white, green on the bottom. It's just a really nice looking card. That set is a fun set with a lot of great players. Number 25. Wesley Walker. Wes Walker, not Wes Welker. Legend. Vinny Testicles. 
Private Signings, that's an on-card, and I really like that set also. Joe Klecko, lineman, he's a legend. He also made a cameo appearance in Smokey and the Bandit. And another Joe Klecko. Don Maynard autograph. One of the most beautiful autographs in all of football. Just look at that and marvel at it. Curtis Martin. That's an awesome autograph. Number to 250. Got a Ronnie Lott autograph. I just put this in here because he did play with the Jets, but I do have him in with the Chargers as well. A really nice Ladanian Tomlinson inscribed number 21. That's out of playbook. And weird numbering, the 61. Go oh, figure, Panini sucks. And another one of these beautiful Top Supreme. There's a Joe Na uh, Namath. Love that card, number to 55. I love a lot of my cards. And finally, to end part two of three is the Detroit Lions. The first card I'm going to pull out and show is the old Thunder, Barry Sanders, whoosh, Lightning, Scott Mitchell. Love that set. That's a great insert set. That insert at one point was big bucks. And it may even still book for 15 bucks or so. Here's a Barry Sanders trophy collection. Not easy to find. And it still books for 30 bucks. Alex Karras, rest in peace, buddy. Say hi to Webster for me. Yale Larry, old school immortals. That's numbered to 125. Just an absolutely off the hook colossal patch here of Calvin Johnson, number to 25. Look at that. That patch is that patch is thrilling. It, it really is. It's thrilling. Another thrilling patch. Barry Sanders, three color patch. Hard to find one that's not paint. That is patch. Number to 50. Oh, it just keeps getting better. Doak Walker, look at that old school shit right there. Oh, oh, I'm starting to shake. Oh, look at me. <laughs> awesome. Another Sanders, Charlie Sanders autograph. Great photography in that set, going way up above. Who's he burning there? Carlington, Garland, what the hell is that? I don't even know who that is. Herman Moore autograph. We got a Bill Dudley, inscribed Hall of Fame 66, cut auto. That's really cool out of classics, number to 100. Love this card just because it is so amazingly stupid looking. That look on his face and the fact that he's wearing that hat that is clearly the artist did not get the proper perspective of hat to face. It's hilarious, and that's why I want it in my collection. Billy Sims got a Lem Barney. Nice on-card auto. Beautiful Calvin Johnson. And I do have a lot of these players I also have in other sets that are completed. Dual autographs and whatnot like the SP Rookie Threads. Calvin Johnson. And of course, to finish it off, number to 49, the Barry Sanders passing the torch. And that concludes part two of three. My legends, Hall of Fame football players. Spotlight. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.